Hello everyone, Mike Rempel from Another Set of Eyes with today's Excel Bytes blog post. Today we're going to take a look at the steps that you can use to fill in a large area of data quickly. So here I have an example of three columns, A through C, and I have data highlighted all the way down to row 500. And I want to fill that in with a formula, with some text, something I want to fill it in uh, all the cells um, with the same information. So I can sit and I can drag and highlight the information, but you know what happens when you, you highlight. Sometimes you go down and you go down too far and you need to go back up, etc., and just find the right spot that you want to end at and then scroll back up to the top and then start entering your data. But an easier way to do this is the steps that I have here. So you click on your first cell, in this case A1, and then where the end cell that you want to highlight to, you type that into your name box. So in this case, cell C500. And then you hit Shift Enter, and it'll highlight all the cells in that area. Now, if I wanted to type, say, ran between formula to enter a bunch of random numbers, I could just start typing and the uh, Excel will take me right back up to that first cell that was highlighted. I'm going to hit my tab, say I want to do numbers 1 to 10, close that, and then I hit Control Enter, and now I've filled all the cells down to C500 with that formula ran between. Uh, that could be uh, a formula or it could just be some data. Whatever, hitting Control Enter will fill it all in at once. So that's a much simpler way by using the name box and Shift Enter to highlight all the cells between your first and last cell. And there you go. Hope you like it. Thanks for stopping by. If you'd like to see more, please go to my blog, excel-bytes.com, and feel free to subscribe. Happy Excelling.